Get me. Hit me. Hit me. Swing it, Sammy. There's a... Ah. Hey, we're getting going on the show early here. There's a there's a guy down at the local pubbery. I don't know if you remember Andy. Travels the world, lives with his mom, blah, blah, blah. Very aromatic. When he wants a, when he wants another beer, he just goes, hit me. Really? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hey, you know what? It's uh, no, I don't. Spectrum Cycling. I don't know nothing from nobody. This is show 252. I'm rearranging. Dun, dun, I'm rearranging dun, dun, stuff dun, on the dun, desk. Dun, you see dun, that? Dun, 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 dun. It's a kind, whatever. Lighter. That's I Tony. Got one. That's Tony over there. That's JK with the. Uh, how many years old? What? Your shirt. Public image. Fourteen. Fourteenth year. Limited. Yep. Today would be the. Wait though. What year is it for the WMSC? Because I believe I'm wearing thirty-five today. Thirty-five. So thirty-five in there. So this is almost the same age, man. I don't. What? I haven't been wearing cycling shirts to work, oh, so no. I had to wear one today. It's seven, eight years old. <laughs> that one's older. Yeah. Fourteen. Yeah, Fourteen years. years. Fourteen years. years. Then you tack on or subtract Johnny Rotten's age from by his, the high pot from his shoe size. Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Depending on how snarky he was that day, dude. He. It was funny because he was like being all. Me- I remember it. He was like being all mellow, and then all of a sudden he just like, yeah. And he's just blowing snot rockets well, on stage. And I'm like, all right. Can you still do that when you're 80 and get away with it? Yeah. Uh, saw Patty Smith. And she was running around on her thing, and she's a spitter. And she would just, like, spit on stage. And I don't know. It, it was re- awesome. It reminds me of baseball I, players. Yeah, totally. And I kind of forget about it until you're, like, audience of it going, like, yeah, that's why I paid the fucking 50 bucks for it. So apparently, Bikini Kill m- must not be selling because today there's half off tickets. Sure, but my my opinion of that is: is why on earth would you want to go see Bikini Kill at the Riverside? You can't dance. Yes, you can. Oh, you can mosh pitting up in the front. On the front, but that means you got to get there at like no, four thirty no, in the you, afternoon. No, you just get high security with a little. Zzz, zzz. Then you yeah. break break out the. Chairs and, so da, 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 da. Right. and that's how so, you do it. Tony, you riled up the MKE bike uh, Goodness Facebook me. business there. Hey, man, I can't help that it. Was... I saw him today again, too, I think, but I was coming from behind, and he was, oddly enough, you he... ready for this? On the beer line. <laughs> oh. Which apparently is okay. It's just that one sidewalk, and that guy is a jackass. South side of Locust Street Bridge, right? South side of Locust Street Same place he was when he was pointing to all of us one day. Oh, him and his buddy were running, and he kept about, he but. kept pointing to the bike lane because we were on the side. Yeah, go down there. Com- yeah, I'm like, if you're comfortable no, down there. No, I've been a prick that way on the other side. I'm not going to cast stone. This is, yeah, I'm not going to die I, on this hill. I even, for this asshole, I even <laughs> pulled over and stopped. Yeah. Because I had gotten gonna to the little, <laughs> I got to the little part on the east side where there's that area where you can start running on the trail. And I pulled over and stopped for this guy to run by me. And he just kept pointing at the at the bike lane. Oh, yeah. I, I thought I saved the 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 law, which says the south side's okay mm-hmm. because it's connecting the beer line with the oak leaf. Right, right. And people drive in the bike al- lane. alleged bike lane in their cars. Yeah. So, <laughs> uh, but the north side apparently is not, not okay. Not to mention seven ten in the morning. He's the only other person on the bridge. Really. Kind really, of, he, he may have been called a jackass a few times by you or yeah, others? by me. <laughs> no, I almost turned around. I was so mad. What is the Facebook MKE BKE BKE? Yeah, if you're in the Milwaukee area, you might want to check for that out. all your Milwaukee bicycle shenanigans. Sh- yeah, shenaniganery needs. That got like at least fifty people. Yeah, commenting. I mean, you know, well, and it, yeah, even it's the a big group. even the shittery on the well, every comment pool is mm-hmm. gonna have yeah um it wasn't that toxic <laughs> there was one guy who wants two lanes in both directions and, right well, there was that guy i was just saying it wasn't that toxic it never <laughs> i don't think it ever i don't think really, it was ever two lanes not legally. real two lanes although right. they no certainly used it. okay 
and now we're giving it more oxygen. The fire might not be. <laughs> This is something. He's not listening. Here's he's here's, not listening. here's something for our, our, uh, our audio listeners. We have we do a thing with the camera thing. Now. Hey, uh, tune in. There's a link to the channel in the show notes at the full spectrum cycling dot com. I probably never told anybody what the actual website is. That's why nobody goes there. Thank you. I do. Come again. Thank you. Come again. Is that how you access the show, or do you get it through a podcatcher of some type? I access it straight from the website. I don't gotcha. have any podcasting type. JK doesn't listen to the show. I do. I do. <laughs> I, I, yes. Now I have to, like, see how I'm sucking my gut. Because, well, the shirt fits well. Well, yeah, this one does. The future mic. Yes. Uh, <laughs> the clutch shirt, that's why I had a thing on uh, like this, like because it's... Mm. Snug. Have you seen? I think it's another Facebook thing that that's some Milwaukee bullshit. Oh yes, no. I love that. Oh, it's, it's just a beautiful, it's, beautiful commentary. It's got of its life. it's got its moments, and, and but this is my own take on that. Pizza Man might return to Downer Avenue. Did we talk about that last? Yeah, time? but with a different owner. It's not Pizza Man then. Uh, yeah, uh, maybe it'll de- be good. Mike Ooh. is dead. Mike is dead. Long live Mike. Oh, Mike died. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh yeah, he died like a fucking decade ago. Oh. Okay. I think. I don't know. Maybe. But <laughs> we're running down this Milwaukee minute or five yeah. or so. Yeah. So last Friday was the bring a bike, get a ticket to the Lake Express. There's still a way to do it. Yeah. It's on the dun, dun. link today. Yes. You need to call them. I think it's only the, I think you call the Madison location. And you get. A round trip ticket, which is normally one hundred and eighty bucks for a hundred bucks, still a yeah. hell of a deal. Should be. Yeah, and I think it's fitting for the bike or something. It t- costs a couple extra bucks to put your bike on there. Yeah, it's fifteen, at least last, last Regi- trip. Registration for the twenty four is on Sunday. Thirty four, the, th- <laughs> the River West thirty four. Yep. That'll be fun. I got to get an email out to the team. Today. Yeah, I have to dance this tonight or tomorrow. This weekend, I have to dog sit at some point throughout the weekend, and I'm got to spice. Dogs like parks. <laughs> Not this one. <laughs> <laughs> There's going to be a lot. I've Not had yet. a lot of dogs there, Not too. Not yet. Oh, yeah. Weather's supposed to be this, this is a dog that does not need more stress. And that's all I'm that's going to show be. up <laughs> later than usual, I've decided. I'm not going to spend the night. Are you doing the registration for the whole Scardinas team? Yeah. Well, I have to sign up and do the lottery. Are you going to wear your helmet when you're racing? Yeah, of course. <laughs> Tony got me into the nutcase. Great, I love that helmet. It's a great helmet. Those so, cases and, are good. I haven't then, seen that enduro style. This is their cases. city. Right? It's, yeah, yeah it's sort of the commutery. Type. Yeah. But not, this thing, I know other companies have had this, this kind of adjustable deal. It's the greatest. But it allows to wear the hat. Oh, yeah. See how I, wore, sound? I wear it with my Mediposa hat. So, uh, Kali. Uh, Kali does as well. Yes, they, yes do, they do. But are they, they do. still available? I don't know. They probably are. I don't know. <laughs> it is a, it no, is a really just, good mechanism, and you can get this with lights, too, should you feel so inclined. Yeah. I, they're just, I like nutcase uh, stuff. It's yeah. good stuff. Um, Daniel wears a glow-in-the-dark one now, and he tells every kid when we leave school. And they, they, know, how to do the their, they know how to do their casings oh. in, yes. clever, in clever ways. Yeah. For you know, the, and they're for not the ridiculously re- 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 expensive. Mm-hmm. No. Mm-hmm. And so, effective. Check them out. Nutcase. Hey. Do it. Do it. Look at them. Get a MIPS. Yes. Also good because when you fall down a lot, you don't have to replace your helmet as often. Well, and it's like <laughs> 15 bucks more. Why would you not do that? Yeah. You just sure. like buying helmets, maybe. Uh, I you don't know. know. Maybe. Who's, who's riding? Are we riding? Let's, let's get to the, let's do this thing right now. Oh, oh, yeah. oh ding dong. <laughs> what is this doing? It is being it's a ag- It's pedal. aggravating you. It's uh, it's ha- it, it's hams again, folks. Only it's taller. It's taller can't, than the fluffer. Can't really go with the high test stuff all the time. Well, you can, but then you're just a drunk. <laughs> and I'm only halfway there. No, <laughs> then yeah, then you're just like the show all right, off drunk. Jovi. 
Apparently, there's a new Netflix Mountain uh, Jovi yeah. show. Yeah, of course. I'll watch it like next year. I don't want everyone to tell me what to watch. Yeah, you kind of got that thing going. Hey, I always hey, do. hey, you should watch Game of Thrones. Have you have you watched Game of Thrones yet? Never. Yes. <laughs> no. Eventually, That's I like did. But eight years good later, Lord, it's like no. The, that one for me was Lost. Have you watched Lost? I've never seen an episode. Yeah, well, when I had my broken foot and I was stuck on a well, couch, I had nothing to do. Yeah, yeah, it was something. And I was all hopped up on oxycodone. So yeah, I had, Lost like, no was sleep. around the time of like Battlestar Galactica. Where it was like, just like shit on TV. Like, it oh, ended, and I and I almost broke it, the TV. But the Battlestar Galactica had the the Starbuck. <laughs> Who is the female not, Starbuck? The female Starbuck, not the original <laughs> Starbuck. Not Dirk Benedict, right? <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Oh, oh, jeez, oh, cripes! Someone's oh, calling. I don't know. There's a thing. Let me. Uh, I am. there's a glacier coming through that window. Oh, look at that! Hey, welcome to the radio program, caller. Who do we have on the line? Big, sexy. Hello. Hey, Hi, everybody. It's, it's been a long time with the big, sexy business. Can, can you hear me okay? I can hear you just fine. Are you on the dark Excellent. side of the moon? It's not a I'm thing. on the dark side of something. <laughs> so fill us in with what's happening uh, with, with your, uh, your beginning of your season. Dude, I'll, I'll tell you what, New Orleans, I got to uh, New Orleans uh, January 18th, and it's been an awesome nightmare. <laughs> okay. Just like, she, just like she usually is. You know, that makes um, sense. I always call her, a, yeah, I, I always call her a hideous bitch goddess. <laughs> You've had, you know, so she's so beautiful. She's so beautiful. She's so ugly. She's so terrible. She's so awful. She's so nasty. She's so awesome. I had such a good time there. <laughs> but, yeah. You are no <laughs> act, sir. I mean, I mean I'll, I'll tell you what. Um, Heather, Heather is going to be forever in New Orleans. I just dropped her off this morning. She's done. Heather is retired. She's over with. It's over. And uh, I took a job in the shitty French Quarter kitchen and earned myself a new tricycle. Right and on. then I got it stolen. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. I, we didn't well, get yeah. through that whole story, I don't think. it was. You said it was your fault somehow, if I remember right. Oh, no, absolutely was my fault. I know where I am. I know the rules. I... The problem is that me and Heather, we never had any problems. No problems in five years. In and out of New Orleans all the time. No problems. So I'm like, eh, I'll be all right. And then, yeah, it just happened. This new flu. So brand, brand new dry school got stolen. Huh? <laughs> yeah, for sure. Right. Yeah, um, and I, I named her Lucy right before she got stolen. And uh, then uh, I did not know what to do, so I had to do a couple of repairs on Heather so she can get me around town at least. And uh, didn't know what to do, so I uh, came up here to the North Shore, and uh, I'm, I'm in Mandeville. I'm across the lake from New Orleans at the moment. And uh, I... Uh, I came over here. I'm not exactly sure what was going to happen, but then uh, a good friend of mine, Brian, and his beautiful family uh, put me to work in their backyard and uh, put me to work in their garden, and I earned a new one, another new one. Huh. I noticed you made and, a color, uh, you made a color um, change on this one. It looks red or burgundy. Yeah, you might as well put a fucking Atlanta fucking fucking sticker on it right now. <laughs> It's red and black, and then I was like, I, uh, I'm like, Michael okay. Peters? Uh, uh, Michael Peters? Number? <laughs> I didn't hear what you said. No, I'm just, uh, he, he's blathering over there. I'm no, sorry, yeah. in Michael Penix. Oh, okay. Atlanta thing, you said. Right, no, but but it, it, is, it is more of a crimson than a red. 
It looks more like an Alabama bike than a Falcons bike, but at the same time, it's not my ideal color. Sure. But um, it's what I have. It's what I have, and it's what I'm going to deal with. And her name is Isabella. I'm going to call her Izzy. It's my mom's and, name. And uh, me and Izzy, is that your mom's name? That's my mom's and my daughter's name. All righty, then. I got a, I've got a Bella, I've got a Bella in uh, Detroit. Got a and, niece, uh, Bella. But this one's going to be Izzy. We're, we're going to call her Izzy. That's, that's what her name is, is Izzy. Very cool. And uh, we're uh, going to go, we're going to uh, be in Mississippi tomorrow. And we're going to Pensacola, Florida. Ooh. Look at some bikinis, hopefully. And, uh. So we're heading to Detroit. That's right, but the um, uh, Matt Gates. Where is Matt Gates? No, oh, he's over there somewhere. He's standing. Isn't he in standing the... proud? There he is. Right there, there I see him. Yeah. If you see him in Florida, you yeah. can run yeah. him over, please. Yeah. Isn't he in that little <laughs> zone that okay. you were speaking of? Pretty sure. Well, yeah. Um, I didn't get a chance uh, for my <laughs> for my my bike guy in New Orleans didn't get a chance to get her. Get his hands on her, so uh, my brakes aren't quite right, but um, we're just gonna have to deal with that for now. Well, yeah, she's brand new, she's ready to go. Um, the basket's different, it's smaller. I, uh, I'm gonna get on the horn with Schwinn tomorrow and see if I can't get a basket exchange. I want a basket like Heather. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't just know. Gotta how work it, work it, work it. Yeah, they've uh, they, sh- they, yeah, are, they well, are they sponsoring you this time? Well, I'll tell you what, and this is heartbreaking for me. I, I, I really don't like talking about it. I sent a uh, multiple paragraph email to the person who's in charge of public relations at Schwinn, and I poured my little heart out. I told the whole story. It was really, I've, I've, had, I've had other people read it. And they're like, that was really well written. That is wonderful. That's a really good, you know, really good letter. I've gotten zero response. And not, I'm like, not, not even okay, a go take a some, flying leap kind yeah, of response. Or cease and desist. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, not, 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 we have not received even a, it, and we will get back a, to you between six thanks, and eight thanks weeks. For, right. Th- thanks for buying Schwinn. Thanks for buying Schwinn and riding Schwinn for five years, and now you've bought three tricycles from us. Go fuck yourself. Nothing. Not a response whatsoever. So I don't know. What, I, I'm thinking about resending it. Um, S- send it to us so yeah, we can we um, can at least read it. Maybe yeah. we'll maybe we'll put it on the website and get a groundswell of our hundreds of site viewers per month. Might just. You know, swarm, swarm legion, them. legion, swarm. rise, legion, and swarm. Yeah, I, I, I can, <laughs> I can do that. Uh, sh- shoot me, a, shoot me a good email um, to send it to, and I'll, I'll do that. But I mean, you know, right it, 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 I, I mean, when, when you read the email, you're gonna, you're gonna see that it took me a very long time to type that on a phone. You know. Oh, understand. I really, I, I put my, I put my mind. It's not like a couple of sentences. Um, I like told the whole story, and I um, literally like poured my little heart out, and I got no response, which was really heartbreaking. Hey, does does anybody here, including Big Sexy, know what Thor's hammer's name is? Yeah, yeah. Did you see? You saw Thor's hammer last week, didn't you? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't know. So, big sexy. You know our buddy Dave, uh, Dave Lunds dot com, uh, DFL, Dave fucking Lunds. Oh, I, is, is he there? No, no. but he, but it's but the hammer he made for me in his but his hammer is. is a welding instructor now. Oh, okay. His students made this hammer. I'm going to show it. Yeah. So if you're going to watch, the, if you watch this on the YouTube, you'll see it. You'll see it. Uh, ah. But it's but it's badass. This here, this thing weighs twenty pounds. To the Dun, nice. dun, I mean, dun, dun, it's dun, twenty dun, pounds. Dun, 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 dun. Uh-huh. That's, 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 yield check this thing out. Hammer. I don't want to drop it on the computer, and my back just went out because yeah. I 
I, oh. Jesus H. So they layered? <laughs> so they took, you know, that's how he taught the guys to weld. This is a, weld, it's a welding exercise. <laughs> nice. Right there. That's and cool. then Dave added this and then left that for me to cut, cut my hand up on right there. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Sounds like Dave. You but probably shouldn't it's, handle it's, that without leather gloves. It's dead nuts on 20 pounds. Is it? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to smash something with it. I might go all Gallagher on oh, yeah. uh, a watermelon, watermelon or watermelon, a watermelon. watermelon or something. But anyway, check it out, Big Sexy, on the video. It's, <laughs> it's. I mean, I can barely hold it up with my, oh. Whoa. I'm impressed <laughs> with <laughs> your uh, stamina, <laughs> good sir. I got I got a I got a shout out I got a shout out to the Holt brothers Michael and Tim and Dave 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 has uh, has donated uh, to the cause kept my phone locking a couple times when it was, when it was getting a little sketchy and and uh, man what a nice well what a what a nice fella yeah I saw that Tim Holt said uh, oh, yeah, had but, helped you out too that was awesome oh my God. Unbelievable! I, I, I don't, if it wasn't for Tim, Tim and Michael, I don't know if I would have made it. All right, man. Hey, do you want to? Um, do you, you want to? Do you want to hang out for a little bit? We actually have another caller. Believe it or not. Yeah, well, I'll, I'll, I'll hang out. Um, you know, if you, do your thing. I'll, I'll listen in. Uh, cue me in if you want me to talk a little. Right on. All right, man. We'll talk to you soon. I'm here. Just keep, no, I, you want me keep to be here listening, not? listening, listening, keep on listening, listening, listening. <laughs> well, <laughs> it's, it was the Dory theme from, from Finding Nemo. I don't know. Keep what, on oh, swimming, man. swimming. Wait, welcome to the radio program, caller. Who do we have on the line? No idea. Hey, it's Seely Dave, guys. Hey, Seely Dave. Seely Dave. What's happening up in the? I don't uh, want bumping. I don't want. I don't want bumping sexy. That's kind of a hard act to follow. <laughs> well, we'll we'll get back to him. I just wanted to uh, hear from you about your upcoming trip and maybe just a quick update. What's going on up in in the North Woods there? Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I just have a rare glimpse of the sun and blue sky uh, for. Uh, handful of hours this afternoon so i'm sitting by the fire listening to cool and the gang and yeah. having a beer and <laughs> cowboys cowboys chewing and blowing but um but yeah i'm coming to milwaukee on thursday uh adventure cycling association is in town in milwaukee that day and they're having a bike packing event mm. at the wheel and sprocket bay in bayview in the evening i think like 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. or something like that. Um, check out Wheel and Sprocket's Facebook page or something like that or web, website for that. But I, I'm pretty sure it's like 5 p.m. to 7-ish. And there's a variety of – it's a it's an Adventure Cycling Association thing. I think Noel Cagle is still on the board of Adventure Cycling, but um, they asked me to come down. You should uh, congratulate. So I'm going to come down. I'm going to bring my bike packing – gear library i'm going to i think i'm going to bring my omnium no cowboy but i'm going to bring my dog packing rig and um also a bunch of stuff about you know bike packing up here as well as i'm i stopped at some of the local chambers hayward and cable and brought some of their i'm going to bring some of their visitors guides down too um so adventure then, if anybody so wants to, just adventure cycling yeah, go ahead sorry is, the adventure cycling association a little more like road oriented versus bike packing or have they gotten into the have they drank you know, the Kool-Aid they were yet? The first, yeah, yeah. They were the first um they were the first sort of like touring nationwide touring organization and and they built their organization, it's a non profit, they built their organization around providing routes and maps and, and guides for people who wanted to go kind of on longer distance tours um, across the U S they still maintain a whole bunch of those routes. However, relative to bike packing, I believe they were the first ones to map the, um, not the race, but the, but just the route version for sort of like touring use of the great divide mountain bike route. I mm. think adventure cycling had that map first it it was like a race first before then but i believe they they 
they mapped the route. Yeah, that's, um, that's cool. Down from like Banff, Banff to Mexico. And I think you can still get that route, those route maps from them. And they've got really good GIS people on their staff who produce these really very high quality um, handheld as well as digital um, maps for touring. But um, but they're getting into bike packing more as that's become more popular. And I like I said, I think Noel is on their board and he's going to ha- – I think he's hosting something at Wheel and Sprocket and they asked me to come down. So I'm going to come down with sort of my – bike packing uh lending library so people can see what that's about um like i said some brochures i'll have my computer to talk about routes if anyone wants to ask a question about routes and so this is something i'm kind of excited about i've been um mapping mapping the locations pois for waterfalls in the upper peninsula oh cool oh, all right on. between i've been I've been looking at um, various websites as well as I've got some really good waterfall guidebooks that have like the lat long locations. So I've been like copying and pasting lat long locations into a ride with GPS map and, and just plotting all these points with the goal of creating kind of like a base map. And I'll probably create a couple of routes, but the idea is like, Hey, here's a base map you can basically just turn on like open street map cycling route, which shows gravel yeah. roads versus cool. regular roads. And you could just go ride wherever you want, make your own adventure to all these waterfalls. Shit, I think yeah. there are over 300 waterfalls just in the UP. Wow. Yeah. Cool. I like, probably got 150 of them mapped right now. That's a lot. Yeah, of I, still working I, I knocked a couple. And I'm adding so, camp wait, wait. You you got 150 mapped already. There's 300. You'll be finished next week. <laughs> no, I, I've you remember I've had a hernia, so I've had like a month <laughs> where I've been like going no, grand, crazy. Grandfather's hyena gets aggravated. We should also, uh, it, when you when you do see Noel, congratulate him on selling his house in less than twenty four hours in River West. <laughs> He's an expat from River oh, West. Oh, did now. he? I ran into him at swim class for our oh. kids. And yeah, he's. I'm like, oh, I didn't. I, know he I, sold his house on his house on Humble. Right? His house on Humble. Yep, yep. Cra- yeah. Crazy high prices well, on Humble these days. Yeah, there are. He did. Yeah. Well. He did great, as he should. He's a good Being guy. Being that close good. to the gig, and actually, I say, man, look, oh, my God, how can seeing, you be that close to I the I saw gig? the inside of the pictures, the inside of the house as I'm clicking through the pictures, and it dawned on me that it was Noel's. And I'm like, oh, my God, this is really a beautiful home. He, It, it is seriously oh, yeah. a, tr- a very traditional, beautiful home. He, and he, the yeah, work I've he did on it, it, yeah, um, it's he great. Did, he actually did a lot of remodeling. Yeah, he did. Uh, yeah, he so did. it's a traditional but he did a lot of work to it. Um, and I was in, I'm surprised, Tony, you've not been in it because it's always been kind of a party spot on the River West 24 route. Yeah, but I'm, um, I'm racing, man. Geez. I'm racing. I'm in it to win it. <laughs> yeah. well, we, got a, we got a little strategizing to do. We always got to have somebody on the course, the man. Not, always someone on the course. No, I like reading the it's, signs. It's, they it's the very have. first all-electric team. I, oh, I like God. the, oh, God. I like the idea <laughs> of the, out, we're I'm probably out. not, but um, I do like their sign that they usually put up asking for, like, what's your poll? As you do laps, I oh, think it's just great. Yeah. Like, you know, pepperoni or, you know, sardines or, you know, stuff like that as you roll by. It's just, I, they've right. always been, I, whoever moves in there better realize that they are accepting the responsibility <laughs> to keep that tradition alive. Right. Yeah. But, yeah. but it's just market right. research well, for their, their company. Neighborhood shaming <laughs> slightly. Slightly. Frankie just moved to Pierce Street. He's right around the corner from Art Bar. Um, one block north, half a block north of Art Bar on Pierce, like nineteen hundred block or something like that. Um, how close? And she's doing a team this year, but how close is that? Is that to the route? You know, uh, one block. Yeah, a block yeah. off. Yeah, or in the but, yeah, you know, it's it. your own route anyway. There isn't an official route. You, there's Wait. only official checkpoints. She is, is she it, on the corner through the checkpoints? You would be she's, in no. The pit. She's around. She's mid block on Pierce. Okay, block on Pierce. Okay. Yeah, she's on the route technically. Is Pierce is technically yeah, it's right on the route. in the zone for for JK's step peoples, isn't it? Is that on Pierce or no? That's Fratney, maybe. 
Yeah, we're fattening, man. Yeah, whatever. All right, Dave. So at <laughs> uh, at uh, Wheel and Sprocket Bayview, and it's Thursday night. This this Thursday night, yeah. All right, well, night. stop on like down. It's somewhere we ought to go. Yeah. Say hi. All right, man. Well, thank oh, you for calling. And, uh, JK, um, I'm, Yo. What, real quick, uh, I might stay in town Friday night. What shows are going on? I can Google this, but I'll just ask you. Low Street Jackets at Shank Hall, thirty or I'm sorry, oh. tw- twenty five dollars a head. That's, that's a good, bad. Sh- that's a good show. Your death personally, yeah, I yeah. Hate your that's we, we all have that. I know, I know, I know. But it's the thirtieth year see. of Low Street Jackets. Doing surf that's, rock, that, right. that's, surf that's, rock, that's, and over, lucha libre. Can... Right. Yeah. No. Yeah. Okay. All right. I, I, I'm one hundred percent with you. Though. The show. Yeah, he's a douche. <laughs> All, All right. right. We'll see you on Thursday. Okay, oh, I said it, Peter. All, All right, right, Dave. Right. <laughs> yeah, he Thanks, saw. It. Bye, 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 Dave. He saw who said it too. <laughs> I don't care. What? <laughs> I don't care. He's a douche. Y'all motherfuckers need he's Jesus. He's a real nowhere man, man living sitting in, in his nowhere, nowhere land called whatever, whatever, <sighs> whatever. I give him. If I see him in the world, I don't I don't flip him off immediately. <laughs> but you think about it, don't no, you? No, I go, hey, how you doing? You know, something. And just wait for the no. cascade well, of I'm, well, I'm boom, still, boom, the other way. Right. Oh, yeah. It you takes are. like Those zero are, to I didn't, zero. I didn't hear myself click off. You're here, you're here, baby. Those guys are just talking what? over there. Yeah, we're All right, well, and let me tell you why I don't like Peter Just. I went to see, I think, Butthole Surfers uh, at her. Kenwood when he when he uh, was running the show. I was on the list plus one. I didn't know I was plus one, so I walked up to the ah. thing. He's standing there, and I'm like, hey, um, I'm, you know, I think I'm on the list, and I was, and he Check me off. He's like, who's your plus one? I was like, oh, I didn't know I was plus one. So, like, I turned to my friend behind me. I'm like, hey, you're getting in for free. And he's like, no, you're not. And he wouldn't let that person. But, he didn't want a but a plus yeah. one, you can bring anybody to the wedding. He asked my plus one because I didn't know about it. That's just terrible. And that's just indicative of all of his Peter, UAB interactions. Damn it, Peter. And they would have <laughs> made more money because there would have been one more person there. It's stupid. All right, Dave. Well, he did. The, my friend did pay, but all right, okay, wow. that's it. But yeah, twenty-five. I, I know. I'm gonna like. I I might grudge fuck. Uh, uh, Ooh, he's throwing that oh, out. Oh, that's a big term right there. Well, uh, yeah, <laughs> twenty-five bucks to go see Little Story Checks on their thirty-year anniversary. Yeah, it's not bad, maybe. Dude. It's not bad. Dude. Yeah, that yeah. sounds. I pretty have. Good. I, I also have like good. dog sitting duties that I have to de- dance and do a little gymnastics with. So, all right, Dave. Thanks again. Uh, Talk to you. Talk to you Thursday. All right. See ya. Okay, bye. See you at the show. All right. Dave Slabowski, baby. Oh, one thing I was going to ask him about the gear library is, is it only pick up up there or would he like ship it to you so you could check it out? I'm pretty sure it's mostly for up there, but whatever. All right. Big Sexy, you still with us? I'm with you. Hey. Huh. There he that is. Was quite inter- that was that was entertaining, dude. Did you get to did when you when you're, most of the show I've ever listened to? What when you're <laughs> <laughs> when you're listening on the phone? Can you hear everything okay, or is it garbled and shitty? Yes, it, it, it's a little bit garbled, but I can hear I can hear everybody talking. I can hear I can hear what you're saying. I'm like, all right, uh, everything's garbled. Like he's going to go to a show or two. Yeah, we've we've used this same. I can, I can do garbled. Yeah, <laughs> but I'll listen to it later, and it'll be like, oh wow, that's actually clear. Yeah, and they're like, no. Well, shit. we've we've been I using this. Like I was like eating fucking same marbles. Bar three, two. For, well, we've been using the same the same, the, same the, same, the call in system we've been using. We've been using for like ten years, and I'm always like, yeah. I've never sure. been on. Well, maybe I have been on the call in end, but not very often. Like when I was in Vegas, I might have called in what? to the show, but probably not because nobody was running. But I called the show. in from Seville, Spain. <laughs> oh yeah, I, I, I feel <laughs> like an, I feel like an asshole. I feel like an asshole for not even recording a message for your anniversary. I'm so sorry, I missed it. I 
I was Hey, busy. it's not too late. Just call the call-in number, 717-727-2453. That spells bike. bike. Yeah. You can call that, in any time you want and leave a message. The, that's the number I just called. If it's not a stupid message or an inane <laughs> message or whatever, we'll use it in the show even if you can't it's make me. it. It's me. Of course it's going to be a stupid message. <laughs> Oh boy! Okay, but um, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be in Detroit uh, in mid June. <laughs> Detroit, and then and Rock so City. you know what that means. Rock City. No. You, you're a Kiss fan. You know what that means. Do tell. No, I'm I'm gonna be in Detroit mid June, so I'm probably gonna be uh, taking the boat across the lake uh, right around twenty four. That would be. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Did you hear today about, well, it doesn't matter if you're only doing the One Direction. But one the Direction? One Direction. Is that where Marky Mark came from? Or I think so. Spinny oh, Spin or no. whatever? Anyway. No. Um, the, no, uh, um, but uh, I'm pretty sure I'm an illegitimate father of one of those kids. Yeah, you're as good looking as most of them. Uh, anyway, so it uh, probably doesn't help you much, but you might have not been on the show when we said that. For a $100 donation to Dream Bikes, you can yes. get a round trip ticket on the Lake Express, which is worth one hundred and eighty dollars. So it's almost fifty percent off. Right. Da da. And, and if you have to go back that way, whatever, whatever. But yeah, uh, yeah I don't know. Gi- they'll give you the ticket, and the money will go to the keep us cool posted on place. the dates because we're going we're going up north to the Badger Ferry, and we're going to do that in late June, early July. But it wouldn't be out of the question to come over on the big old uh, Lake Express and escort Big Sexy back into Milwaukee. That'd, that'd be great. I'm, I, um, now that I know uh, I still got at what speed I have to deal with, yes. <laughs> oh, no, no. Um, but, but no, it, it's I just was so, thought. Hey, Izzy. <laughs> Izzy, is, Izzy goes slow, baby. Oh, 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 is, is, oh. Izzy, is Izzy like the same tempo as, as Heather, or is it because it's Absolutely. six years <laughs> zesty? <laughs> All right, brother. Well, it's, the same bike in the ugly, it's the same bike in the ugly color. <laughs> <laughs> it looked like it had some hydroform tubes, in case you want to look that up. It's a real fancy thing that says it's probably a stronger bike. I don't know. Hopefully the wheels are better well, made. See, the, the bat. The basket's smaller. The basket's smaller and different. I don't like it. I want to call Schwinn tomorrow and see if I can get a different basket sent to me because it's just that I don't know if this is going to work. You know, you, you could get a inex- cosmetics. How about an inexpensive walled basket to put on the front, and you could put your consumables in the front, right in front of you, so you didn't even have to stop to get that that bagel or the uh, whatever else fuels you on your ride. Jägermeister. I'd, is he sponsored by Jägermeister still? He should be. Hey, I got a bar for you to I, go to. I am, I, am, I am sponsored by Jägermeister, whether they like it or not. Yeah. Well, they just got a shot ski in, um, which is the stupidest thing I've ever seen, but... Ugh. Yeah. <laughs> that was yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know about the basket. I'm, I'm, I'm going to get on the horn with Schwinn tomorrow and see about, see about a basket exchange because I don't like this basket. Good chance. I hope you speak Indian or, uh, you know, Filipino or some other language. Indian, actually. Yes. Probably India, I would imagine. Oh, okay. Oh, they speak okay. a lot of different I'm, languages. I'm, 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 I'm going to call you out, dude. I'm going to call you out. Every single time I've ever dealt with Schwinn customer service, it has been an American, and they have been wonderful to me every single time. I don't care if they ignored my email, my heartfelt email. They have, Schwinn has been taking care of me for five years. Right on, man. And well, they're look, great. Don't forget to I'll, I'll send you, I, I, I'll send you I, an email. I, I, don't, I, don't mean, I don't mean to stomp on you like that, buddy, but I'll tell you what, Schwinn has been awesome. So, yeah. Well, I didn't, yeah, right on. I'm glad they take care of you because who else will? Somebody has to. <laughs> All right, we're going to wrap this sucker up. Thanks, yeah, thanks for calling in. You're welcome to call in anytime. Keep us appraised of your right, route uh, and, and um, more like importantly, I said, timing. Like I said, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at Milwaukee mid-July, maybe late July. I'll, I'll, I can I can stretch it out if I have to. I'll go up to Franklin, Michigan and hang out for a while. 
Works for us, but uh, you know but, the um, dates. What are the dates this year, Tony? 26 and 27. 26 and 27, Happy last birthday, Friday and Saturday. So here's something interesting about the 24 this year is that it's on a different weekend than Brady Street Festival because the stupid Harley, I mean, I'm sorry. What? Not Harley riders. No, they're not stupid. But what is stupid is yes. this constant every single year thing, which will be the weekend before the River West 24. And because they're in close proximity, they decided to well, bump that back a week because the 24 is so important. I'm going with that thought. Nice. Well, well, 24 ain't going to move. I'll tell you what, man. It was, so, it was so good to talk to you guys. If you could uh, put my uh, put my Venmo uh, link in there, it would be great. The, the any donations are wonderfully appreciated. Right on. Um, I'm pretty much starting off with less. I'm starting off with less than I did on Heather in July 2019. So um, and it, it, I'll, I'm going to make it, no problem. But anything always helps, and, and it's no big whoop. I, I'm, I'm going to make it, and I'll be in contact. We'll, we'll talk to you maybe in a, a week or two, and I'll, I'll call you up and see what you're all up to. Yeah, once you're on the Sounds road, good, man. give us an update. What's her name? Annalisa? Annalisa? Isabel. Izzy. Izzy. Izzy, Isabella, but Izzy, yeah. All right. Later on, Here's you. Here's how it goes. Hey, Bye. Look. Peace. All right, take it easy now. That was big sexy for the first time nope. in a good long time. For for correction, right before we go off the air. <laughs> Live. Izzy slash Isabella is my daughter's name, not my mother's or my niece's. There. I, huh? named, I named my kid Isabella because everyone else took Isabel. There you go. <laughs> So thanks for cl- when he said at the end, it's I'm like, on, oh, yeah. I should probably tell you. Clarify. Hey, you know how many wax. times uh, I think Big Sexy is the one that the, the caller, he's called in the most, 72 times. Wow, 72 to. times. He needs to shoot for 100. 100. We could have a Big Sexy 100 or anniversary show. 100. <laughs> you got to follow him <laughs> on the road. It's like, oh, oh shit. Do you have to I'm bring? I'm at this little no. shit place in fucking Pahrump, Utah. Does he have to? Do we have to ride, or can we just walk along with him? <laughs> you got to find him. He's like a geo. Oh, cache. I see him. He's still listening. How you doing? You're a geocache. We're giving you shit, dude. All right. Well. Thank you very much for spending another whatever, whatever with us. And uh, we'll be back next week.